a cruel lottery of who lives and who dies that the NHS was founded to stop. And until now, until this point, for 75 years, it has. It's one of the greatest privileges of being born in Britain, certainly for all of my life. The knowledge that if you get ill, if you have a serious accident, you'll get the care that you need, whatever your circumstances. I don't think the NHS survives five more years of Tory government. And people say, oh, well, we've heard this before. The Labour Party is always saying it's time to save the NHS. But I say, look squarely in the eyes of the people who work in the NHS, who serve the NHS, and ask them. Speak to the working people who use the NHS, who depend on the NHS, who need the NHS. What do they say? And go to the people who believe in the NHS, love the NHS, but have been forced to buy the care they need from the private sector. Listen to them. No, at the next election, the NHS is on the line. The Conservative Party that's brought it to its knees will put it in the ground.